just going to video. Just going to video all this. Welcome back to the live edition of Flaming Freedom here at the Liberty Forum. We've got a great audience here tonight. Lots of people are coming up and talking to us. Don't bother trying to call in tonight because we aren't able to take calls with our remote setup. But uh, I would like to thank freetalklive.com. Check out their broad broadcast for the setup that is allowing us to do this live show from Liberty Forum. And this is your host, Dale. And Neil. And our special guest. Hey, it's Mandrick. What's up, guys? Mandrick is uh, becoming uh, quite a celebrity for I'm becoming. meeting people at these Liberty events with yeah. great food. and. He's also our token service. straight. Um, I'm claiming freedom pretty often. Although He's like I, a seven on the Kinsey scale, and it only goes to six. <laughs> although, ironically, uh, the last time I did Flaming Freedom, one of the times, I it was with the gayest episode ever <laughs> with uh, Luther. That's right. The yeah. gayest episode oh, yeah. ever of Flaming Freedom yeah. had me and two straight guys. Yep. Mandrick and Luther, and they gayed it up. We gayed it up. Big time. Big I don't time. know how you managed to do that. And oh, really, I know. He really is a seven on the Kinsey scale, yeah. despite the fact that he keeps raping Derek. I am absolutely. I'm, I'm actually a hundred percent gay, except for the whole sex with men part. Right. Well, that's kind of like <laughs> and, me. An attraction I'm, I'm, I'm to a men. lesbian, yeah. aside from the whole being attracted to yeah. women and being a woman. Yeah. I, I'm, I'm not a woman. I'm not attracted to women. But other than that, I'm a lesbian. Yeah. So do you know how to duct tape your genitals? You know, to make it uh, have a lower profile when you're going out. Oh, in, the, in public with my, all your glitter and, and your... Uh, Neil. Oh, he said he was a seven, right? He, no, he's Dale a, said I'm a seven. What is that? Oh, okay. duct taping your genitals. <laughs> he's pretty That's gay. something else, dude. <laughs> I'm pretty gay. Yeah. <laughs> the funny thing is I'm so straight. You know, that's the, actually the funniest part. Nobody ever yeah. believes me, so I'm like, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> well, seeing how you behave with our co-host, Derek... Derek like loves me. He's like the opposite end of it. He's a negative one on the Kinsey scale. Yeah, he, it only goes to zero. He was sitting on my lap during the, sh the start of the show, and he was like giving me kisses and, on the cheek, and I'm like, "Oh, that's so nice." And he's like, and I'm like, you know, I'm totally not gay. And he's like, "Oh, I." He's like, "That's." What, he's like, "You say that now," and I'm like, "Dude, do you feel anything going on in my pants? There's nothing going on down there, dude. Trust me." Oh, you and if there, and if there, well, if I was gay, yeah, we need to hook the Derek would be it. We have to hook up the boner meter. If, if I was, dude, look at Derek. I mean, I, you can, I can look at him and be like, that dude's hot. Right? He, he's, yeah. he's, he's, he's the great. prettiest man in New Hampshire. And the, and the best part is I'm always flirty with Derek, and he's always jumping on me and giving me these big hugs. And Neil and and, and uh, Dale are so jealous. They get so angry about it. <laughs> I, got, I admit, I was talking to you about that. I'm like, why does Derek let me do that kind of stuff to him? And you know what he said? He said, because you guys just don't, you just don't have the nerve to try it. You just got to oh, yeah. get in there. Mm -hmm. Get in there, Dale. Ooh. All right, Dale. So, so we're at the hot tub, and I was with. Uh, right, I was okay, with. Wait, 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 oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Did you record on. that? For no, the no, no. Court no. Case? What? Did you record that when the court case comes up? I don't so. know, but anyway, so we're at the hot tub. I'm, I'm in the hot tub with Dale. <laughs> I'm gonna use that in my defense. And the guy, and the guy working, uh, <laughs> the guy working there, who they were talking about earlier, who they're like, I think oh, he's gay. The gator. I'm starting to feel bad for this guy. The dude's bending over at the pool, like. If his friends are. Hold on, you got. Let me tell the story. Let me tell the story. He's not gonna listen. All right, go ahead. Um. But so the guy's bending over, and we're in a hot tub. He's like bending over, doing something with the pool, and it's his his uh, buttocks is right there, right by Dale. And Dale's like, I just want to stick my face in there and go. <laughs> and I was like, Wow, motorboat. I think, I think we that were in is, a that's pool. That's mudbugging. We were that's in a pool. So mud bugging. Context, mud bugging. I may have said something about diving in head first. You, you. I believe the exact quote was. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's what the quote was. <laughs> there may have been an extra. <laughs> Or not, I don't know. I might be cutting it short. I might be paraphrasing. Yeah, so. Yeah, people people love yelling stuff from the audience, and it's like, when people go back and listen to this podcast, they'll be like, what's going on? I can't hear a thing. Hold your mic right. So, <laughs> there you go. That's not my mic. So, Mandrake, you... Yeah. By the way, I have the official foreskin of the Liberty Movement. Go ahead. <laughs> you know what? Screw you. you. I knew, pretty much knew this I... whole segment was shot when we when we had... I just I haven't mentioned my foreskin all weekend. I, so. I am a victim just you like are. so many of these people you in are. this room, I assume, You're right. of male genital mutilation in the United States, which so is sorry. the most back ass it worst is. thing it is so I have sad. ever it, it is, is sad. You should be able to dock anybody. <laughs> I wanna You should I, be able to dock. I should be able to dock. You should yeah. and I can and I don't because I'm not gay. So what's that is that <laughs> is that like having like this great car and not driving it? <laughs> I'm sure it still behooves a straight guy to have uh, his still have his force. It's fun, you know. It's, you can have so much fun oh, in yeah. the shower. 
I mean, I, I had to do. I love uh, when I was little. I used to do the chalice where you pull it out, you stretch it out, and you put water in it, and then you pinch oh, it off, God. and you make like this little water balloon. This is totally right. FCC friendly. All right, <laughs> right? Come on, the FCC well, loves you know it's, it's over. Forget being FCC friendly. What are you talking about? It's so, it's the FCC. Hopeless. I'm pretty sure one of the C's in there does not stand We're for circumcision. It. It's just, it's no way. <laughs> what are you talking? I'm talking about stretching skin. If you stretch your skin on your finger, what? Is yeah. that so bad? Are you saying we blew it? <laughs> you know what's so funny? When uh, Brett was on the segment, he's like, so how gay am I? But the audience didn't know is he was actually sitting between Neil and Dale, and he was going skiing. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't know what skiing is, just look it up on Urban gonna, Dictionary. But imagine your, both your hands going in a similar motion. We're, we're going to have a demonstrational video on the oh, Facebook great. page. Excellent. You oh. lost me. Even even me. Skiing? You, yeah. Think about it. A, a guy sitting. Again, again. A guy sitting. No, 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 I'm going no, no. to do it for FCC friendly. A man is sitting between two men or a woman, I guess, whatever, and her hands are placed in a certain area, and mm -hmm. they're moving in a direction. Like, how would you move if you were skiing? How would you move your hands if you're holding I, skis? I, I, I'd have both Probably hands on the poles. On the poles. You would have your hands on the poles, exactly. Right. You don't oh. have to say anything more. <laughs> oh, okay. There you go. You're it's talking, like a light just yeah. went on over Neil's so Brett's, <laughs> so Brett's like, hold on, let me stop skiing. Can you guys tell me uh, where I fall on the Kinsey scale? You, you're talking horizontally. I thought no, like vertically. No. There. Okay. You thought. That's your problem. All right. All right. Yeah. No. So what, is it, what does it so, mean from the Kinsey scale perspective if you are intimate with men, not because it's sexually arousing, affectionate, but because you mean? you're... Yeah. I, but I don't because know. you're I don't know, but you're trying to get attention or what is No, that? I'm just I don't I like I like being affectionate. It's fun. It it's nice, you know. Everybody has a need for affection, right? I guess. Yeah, so. yeah. sure. sure. It, that doesn't mean it has right. to be sexual. No. Right. You know? No, I I'm I'm all for it. You won't you won't find me disagreeing yeah. with that. Now when Can you get your you hand out of my pants now? <laughs> well, hey, you were tapping your Well, throat. I mean you might as well finish now. Both both of us, we were in the bathroom about like we 10, 15 minutes ago. <laughs> oh, yeah. You were the one tapping and your foot. So you, go, you brought it up. I go in the urinal, and he goes in the stall. I'm like, what, you got to sit to pee? And he's like, only when it makes a lot of noise because I'm kind of embarrassed. And, I, and he's like, and I said, um, and I said, oh, I said something. Yeah, you said about tapping the foot, but they have these really fancy bathrooms here with these like doors, it's, and there's nowhere to put your foot. It's proof. So they I said, oh, glory but, holes. They have, but they have plant panels. So I'm like, oh, I can just take one of the panels out and make my own uh, impromptu glory hole. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, I, I got to tell you, a couple of years ago when I was uh -huh. at the same hotel is this for a Liberty Hall Forum. Story? This is a, a, almost better a glory, be a glory hole. story. I was invited into one of those bathroom wow. stalls. Well, wow, that's excellent. By yeah. who? By the janitor? No. <laughs> no, by... Is he like, hey, can you clean this up? This is really... By a Liberty messy. Forum attendee. Yeah. I was quite honored. Yeah, that's awesome. Yeah. Was it looking for a, some Blump again action? action? <laughs> Blump, is Blump getting FCC friendly? I only wish. I, I only know. wish. Yeah. I, think it's, I think it's oh, obscure God, getting... enough. I think it's obscure enough to be FCC friendly. <laughs> yeah, well, I meant pumpkin. I like pumpkin pie. Look it up on the Ur Urban Dictionary. Yeah, it's blueberry pumpkin. Blumpkin pie? Yeah, bl Blumpkin. The, uh... It's blueberry pumpkin pie. <laughs> what is the... What is the, uh, the AC Slater Upper Decker Blumpkin. Upper Decker Blumpkin. Yeah, that's... Oh, God, I don't even know how to explain we that one. We, we can't explain it. You have to go look it up. Okay, imagine you're sitting on the top of a, a no, toilet. No, 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 no. I'm gonna, I want to totally make this FCC friendly. And somebody else, <laughs> hey, remember A.C. Slater from Saved by the Bell? He'd sit on the chairs backwards. So someone else is sitting on the chair backwards, and then things are happening. Both people have to defecate. <laughs> so both people are defecating, and then... you got Neil's interest now. Other things are being done with the guy, the guy who's sitting on top and the woman who's sitting on the bottom. Hey guys, this is Flaming Freedom, and we'll be right back with more AC Slater, Upper Decker Blumpkins, and Brett right. Minot skiing. This is the live edition of Flaming Freedom from the Liberty Forum. We've got lots of special guests on tonight, so stick around. There's still more, more to come. More to come. Shut up. We're never having you on again. Yes. Never. Yes, man.